what's going on everybody drew drew's ripping in home repair i don't build houses anymore used to at one time but i have went around to a few construction sites in my area and uh found some good stuff and i found some bad stuff if you want to see some really bad stuff in my opinion go look at a few of my videos that i've posted earlier about uh new construction new construction is not always good construction fortunately today Ran across a good one. Check out the video. Construction going on in my town. Got a house up on foundation. Not yet been nailed yet. I'll tell you one thing. They can drive a few of them nails in. They're just sticking out. That's the proper way to nail. If it doesn't go all the way in, use your hammer to knock it the rest of the way. That's way better than a nail that's penetrating, like in some of my videos, completely through the OSB. So stand straight up and down, well, they, they nail it. That's professional right there, buddy. Yep, that's professional nailing to me. I've always laid my I always had my plywood laying down sideways, but I guess uh, according to code around here, you're allowed to put it up up and down like this. They get, looks like they got some blocking up there at the top. And then they're gonna tie this into the gable end and that way everything will be tied together and hurricane basically proof. It's a pretty good nailing. 90% of their nails are sunk just about perfectly. It's a nice little place, nice place. I would not want to, they're going to definitely have to do some landscaping because we get a lot of rain around here, boy. Whew. I've seen this uh, pond right here. Let me see. I've seen it up into that guy's house across the street there. It's a beautiful little house. This is my neighborhood. I'm glad to see that they're, they're building houses. And, and uh, a lot of these places down here are mobile homes. But um, I, like, I like everything I see here. Look at there. Look at that corner. Oh, no. it is two by six also. It's one of the first ones in this area that I've seen two by six and they're making, they're making solid corners and tees. Look at that. But what everybody complains to me about in my videos is the fact that that spot right there is not getting insulated. So that's the, that's one thing that everybody is uh, mentioning and it's true, it does not get insulated. I think the good thing about that is, check this out, no insulation. The plywood's up already, so it's not going to be insulated. It's, it is a T from the inside, so it has solid nailing for the sheet rockers later on. But I like that they, uh, I like they use um, Adventech. Everybody around here, I don't know about your area, but we always use this on our flooring. I mean, you're building a house. Back when I was building, we used regular three-quarter inch, 23, 30 seconds plywood. Um, and it just got exposed to the terrible weather for a long time uh, sometimes. <coughs> and, uh, yeah, I mean, you could get warped floors. I don't think I have to go in here for any reason. There's nothing in there. But I'm telling you, look at that. There's going to be a two-by-six interior wall right there. And there's a T. So there's going to be a wall on the other side, probably the bathtub, and they're using that for the wall of the bathtub. I don't know. But tees and corners. This is a nice looking place. I love this guy. I don't know who it is. This is basically going to be two houses side by side, exactly the same. Nice. Nice, nice. Compared to the uh, other work that I've been seeing, good God almighty, this is, this is some proper stuff here. I like it. I like it. Built up. This is a beautiful job, guys. Uh, let me see. YMB Construction. Custom Homes and Remodeling. You guys are doing a great job over here. Yep. I want you to go back and look at some of my other videos, guys, and you will see some crap.
Go check out my videos. This is a nice looking place here, I'm telling you. Two by six walls. A lot of people said, why don't they have two by six walls? Well, I, I don't know. I think probably every house should be two by six walls. I like that idea. I like teasing corners, but like some people say, you cannot insulate where the wall ties into the other wall unless you do it before you put up the OSB. All right, guys, I'm out. Hope you enjoyed this video. And uh, please go back and check out some of my crappy video um, jobs that you'll see. This, this job here, these guys are professional, buddy. These guys could build my house anytime. Check out my previous videos. Some of them you won't believe.